take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. How to winterize tankless water heaters. First, the heater should be turned off and the power cord unplugged. The gas and water supply lines should then be shut and the tank drained. When the water pressure reduces, the inlet and outlet water pipes should be disconnected. Let's help you make your mark. Tankless water heater manufacturers recommend their units be flushed at least once a year to eliminate the buildup of calcium and other minerals within the unit, even more often if you have hard water. Some units will indicate when the unit is in need of flushing. Take our lead. Shut off the water supply on the main shut-off valve. Open the taps so the system can drain and release the pressure from the plumbing system. Disconnect incoming and outgoing water pipes from the tankless heater. Remove the inlet water filter. Let's help you make your mark. Tankless water heaters can vent through the roof or a sidewall, creating more flexibility and options for placement. Traditional gas tank water heater require venting through the roof. Tankless water heaters use fans to blow exhaust from the unit horizontally, allowing vents to terminate on the side of a house. Take our lead. Still, the tankless hot water heater can freeze if certain precautions are not taken when the temperatures drop below a certain level. Most indoor and outdoor tankless water heaters have built-in freeze protection against temporary winter temperatures ranging from minus 5 degrees Fahrenheit to minus 22 degrees Fahrenheit. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.